Um, these guys know what they're doing. So they started out brewing at home and then they moved it into a business. And I'll tell you what, they definitely know how to not only brew beer, but they are really hitting it out of the park with all of the different styles of beer. I mean, I just now tried five beers and I didn't give anything below an eight. And you know, I'm, I'm picky about my beers, right? And I like a little different, you know, types of beers. And I'll tell you what, if you find yourself downtown Akron, Ohio, you're coming for a visit, you're visiting relatives, come downtown and support these guys. Okay, so I mean, I these guys are knocking it out of the park, and I can't wait to come back in the future uh, and you know try more beers. Stay tuned because Sean's going to give us a tour of the brewery, and then it's quiz time. All right, so we're with Sean. He is the head brewer yep. here in Akron. Welcome. We're going to walk down here and show you where our new beer garden is going to be this summer. It's a little bit of a mess right now with all the construction, but you kind of can get an idea of what it's going to be like. approaching Commerce Park, um, which the city of Akron has leased to us for the summer for uh, concerts and for the beer garden. So it's going to be right down here, which is the front of the brewery. That is so nice. How many people? Oh, uh, we're not really sure yet. we got to get some of the tables and stuff, but it, it's probably at least 100, 150 people outside, which will double our patio, triple our patio. Wonderful. So that's coming in June. June. So we'll walk back in and then we'll start the back side of the brewery tour. Dock of Acronym in our glycol chiller, which keeps the cooler cold and all the beer cold. canning run on Thursday so we got cans and kegs and everything everywhere it's usually a little more organized than this so this will be your first canning yeah first canning run on Thursday it will be deal at double New England look for that guy on Unzer we'll have that up next week on Unzer and we'll have some in the tap room obviously here's our big cooler with our serving bags So this is our wild program, so this is into the woods, so this is our sour, uh, golden sour aging, which will come out later uh, in September, October. Love the sour. So now we're in the brew house. As you can see, so we'll go from that grain room up to that grist case there. That's the first part of the brewing process. And then that's our mash time right there. So we're a little bit different for our size, so we're a 10 barrel brewery, but we do have a mash mixer and a lot of time and a boil whirlpool. So we're pretty efficient with that, so we can do two brews a day real easy. Um, so big hot water tank, hot liquor tank, then the mash mixer, water time, boil kettle whirlpool. Um, and then this is our fermentation up here. So we have four 10 barrels up here and a 10 barrel break. We're getting ready to uni tank these, so we're gonna we're gonna can off of that tank right there on Thursday, which will be deal. The last tank. Yeah, part of double New England. We just Natural got your can right there. Yep, just got it. Just got the wild goose filler. Um, really love it. We ran a little test run with it. It went really well for us, so we're excited to run this guy on Thursday. We're gonna do about five barrels, probably be about 50, 60 cases.
but we are we are full we full service so we have a drinks menu and we have wine mead and uh, usually cider like I said and then 